Some people can't tell that I have two different color eyes. I forget exactly what the term is for what I am, but I'm one of those people. I have a light brown and a dark brown. People say, well, they're both brown, so they're not two different colors, but they actually are. One's light and one's dark. Can you tell? Welcome to the weekly update for June 2nd, 2014. June 2nd is my son's birthday, so he gets hit 13 times today. And it's also my granddad's birthday, and God rest your soul, Grandpa. Let's see what we got going on this week. Ultra Street Fighter 4 will be coming to the PlayStation 3 and Xbox 360 today. If you're a fan of Street Fighter 4 or Street Fighter 4 Arcade Edition, you'll love Ultra as it adds five new characters, new stages, and tweaks to the already phenomenal gameplay experience. If you already own Street Fighter 4 Arcade Edition, you can buy Ultra as an add-on pack for only $14.99 via Xbox Live or PlayStation Store. Look for Ultra Street Fighter 4 on PlayStation 3 and Xbox 360 now. 1001 Spikes is coming to PlayStation 4, PlayStation Vita, and PC on June 3rd. 1001 Spikes is an 8-bit retro style, hardest, extremest, craziest platform action puzzle adventure, simple and intuitive rules with elaborate level design, various fierce traps, traps and more traps. Return to the golden years of video game. No one can beat this game except you. And if you're up for the challenge, 1001 Spikes comes to PS4, Vita and PC on June 3rd. Call of Duty Ghost Invasion DLC will be coming to the Xbox One and Xbox 360 on June 3rd. Invasion sports four new multiplayer maps as well as Episode 3 of Extinction. The maps included are Departed, which is set in a rural Mexican town, Pharaoh, which is an abandoned archaeological site, Favela, which is a remake of the same level from Modern Warfare 2, and Mutiny, which is in a secretive cove on a remote Caribbean island. Look for Call of Duty Invasion DLC to hit Xbox One and 360 on June 3rd. Hyper Dimension Neptunia Producing Perfection will be coming to the PlayStation 3 on June 3rd. This game is an idol simulator from Japan and was previously released to rave reviews over there. Now in this game you have to take control of a group and sing on stage wowing the audience. You get to see how many fans you have in the audience and how many haters you have in the audience and you've got to keep them entertained. If this sounds like something that you'd like to experience on your PlayStation 3, check it out on June 3rd. Murdered Soul Suspect is coming to the PlayStation 3, Xbox 360, PS4, Xbox One, and PC on June 3rd. The events of this game are set in Salem, Massachusetts and focus on the detective Ronan O'Connor who is slain by a brutal and relentless killer. Ronan returns as a ghost and will not rest in peace until he solves his own murder by using his ghostly powers. This game looks very interesting. Be looking for it on various consoles on June 3rd. Hyper Dimension Neptunia Producing Perfection will be coming to the PlayStation Vita on June 3rd. This game is an idol simulator from Japan and was previously released to rave reviews over there. Now in this game you have to take control of a group and sing on stage wowing the audience. You get to see how many fans you have in the audience and how many haters you have in the audience and you've got to keep them entertained. If this sounds like something that you'd like to experience on your PlayStation Vita, check it out on June 3rd. PlayStation Vita Pets will be coming to the Vita on June 3rd. This is a video game that simulates having a dog and uh, it looks pretty interesting if you're into that kind of thing. And the game you pick from four different puppies, each with their own personality, sense of humor, and character traits. Once you've gotten to know each of them and learn the skills needed to venture outside of the safety of your home, you'll be able to embark on the adventure of Castlewood Island and uncover the long lost legend of King and his dog. Look for PlayStation Vita Pets for PlayStation Vita on June 3rd. Coming to the PlayStation 4, we have War Thunder. This will be coming to the PS4 on June 3rd. War Thunder is an online multiplayer combat game developed by Gaia Entertainment for the PS4. The game is set to contain aircraft, armored vehicles, and ships from the pre-World War II to Korean wartime period. The game also has maps in the game that are directly or indirectly based on real-life battles of the era. So look for War Thunder on PS4 on June 3rd. Coming to the PC on June 3rd, we have Wildstar. Wildstar is a subscription-based open-world RPG 
for the PC. Uh, this game is fantasy based and it takes place on a fictional planet Nexus where a mysterious and powerful race known as the Elden has disappeared leaving behind a wealth of technology and secrets for the players. Players can create, customize their own characters and level them up from levels 1 through 50 so look for Wildstar on the PC on June 3rd. Worms Battlegrounds will be coming to PS4 on June 3rd. Battlegrounds will have new and returning features such as classes from Worms Revolution and the clan system from Worms Clan Wars. Water dynamics in Worms Battlegrounds is also improved. New and features include a map editor to create and test maps for online and offline gameplay. Worms Battlegrounds will be on PS4 on June 3rd. Tamodachi Life will be coming to the Nintendo 3DS on June 6th. In Tamodachi Life, you make memes of your favorite people and watch surprising things happen. What happens when your friends, family, and celebrities become me characters and live on an island? Tamodachi Life, that's what. It's exactly the type of crazy that memories are made of. Give me characters items, voices, and personalities, then watch as they rap, rock, eat donuts, fall in love, get denied, and have little me babies. Wait, what? Tamodachi Life will be coming to the 3DS on June 6th. Well guys, that's your weekly update for June 2nd, 2014. I'm the Beastly Gamer, and I'll see you guys next time.